Well, Jackie sure went all out on me. End of the season gifts. Think the blood's real? <laughs> no, I haven't seen Doug lately. It's true. The winter's tasted kind of funny. Hi. Hey. But it's not just you, Chris. Jackie wants Polaroids of everyone's butt. I did it too. Did you, did you get the tickets? Yeah, I did. Two glorious days in Hawaii. Just think this time tomorrow we'll be wing our way back home. Great. The season's over, now you're funny. Yeah, two weeks on Oahu. Oh, man. Jerry, tell me, are you the kind of guy uh, who freckles or turns into a bronze god? I'm the kind of guy that gets melanoma and dies. <laughs> wonderful year, you know, and uh, I plan on having a few of you guys back next season. <laughs> I've got some great news, though. The network's doing a TV special about me. Jackie Thomas back home, growing up funny. All right. And we're filming it back in Iowa, and I'm taking the writers with me to write some of my spontaneous ad-libs. <laughs> and Laura Miller's going to produce it. All right. It's a great opportunity. I can't wait. You don't have to. The bus leaves at 8 o'clock tomorrow morning. This place hasn't changed a bit since I was a kid. See them guns over there? If I hit the wall just right, they'll all go off at once. Watch. Maybe you can, you can show us later, all right? All right. Okay. This is my great-great-grandfather's house. Yeah. He used to travel with the sideshow. The man with no arms. <laughs> he built this place with his own two feet. <laughs> Park the bus. Here's your clothes, Jackie, and your weight set. I just saw a buzzard eating a dead goat. Oh, cool! It's great to be home! <laughs> hey, uh, nice, nice get up there, Doug. You'll blend right in. I don't want to blend right in with these yokels, Bobby. Right now, I could be in Palm Springs doing brunch with Fred Willard. <laughs> that man treats me like a god. Doug, you gotta be here. Without network supervision, we might do a good job. Hey, nice try, Four Eyes. That was a dead dog being eaten by a crow. <laughs> Jackie, please, can't we just stay at a hotel? Oh, quit whining, Laura. This place is big enough for all of us. Plus, I built a big addition in the back there. I got a couple bedrooms, satellite dish, jacuzzi. Oh, that sounds great. Yeah, I'll be staying there. <laughs> yeah, this dump gives me the creeps. You, know? <laughs> you boys, you're upstairs in the bedroom with the bunk beds. Okay? Laura, you get my old bedroom. Hasn't changed a bit since I was in high school. Boy, that bed can talk. <laughs> I'd probably say, please, God, change the sheets. Jerry, you get my dad's bedroom. Well, where's he gonna sleep? Ah, don't worry about him. He comes and goes. Although, you might want to lock your door at night. <laughs> Doug, you're an executive. You get the basement, right through the kitchen there. Tracky. There's a hideous smell coming from down there. Yeah, I know. Just follow your nose. <laughs> yeah, one more thing, guys. Don't go into the cornfield at night. There's some pretty weird kids out there. <laughs> Can you believe 
believe I have to sleep in Jackie's bed. Maybe Doug will swamp with me. Well, you know what they say, any port in a storm. I am not a port for your storm, Jerry. <laughs> I'm sorry. I, you know, the whole idea is we could be alone together. No, but we're not alone together. We're on a business trip, and I'm very busy. I've got phone calls to make. I've got permits to get. Uh, but couldn't you do that naked? <laughs> <laughs> first time to be romantic and I just don't feel romantic here. Would it help if I was naked? Oh, come on, Jerry. Whoa, Grant, you gotta check this out. He wants to do it and she doesn't. <laughs> you can hear them? Yeah, man, clear as a bell. <clears throat> Bobby, don't you think if you can hear them, they can hear you? Is that true? It's true, Bobby. <laughs> Will you people shut up up there? <laughs> We're gonna start the interviews with you folks because you knew Jackie best in high school. Jackie who? Uh, Jackie Thomas, he was your hey! student. Hey, keep your eyes off your neighbor's paper. <laughs> We're uh, Jackie's writers, ma'am. And save your sass for another class. <laughs> I don't remember a Jackie Thomas. I remember a Bubba Wheeler. Oh, I knew Bubba Wheeler. I had webbed feet. Boy, could he swim. <laughs> Maybe we should do the show about Bubba. Can't. Dead. <laughs> um, are you sure that you don't remember Jackie Thomas? He was in your biology class? Oh, was he the one that was always asking for extra frogs to dissect? <laughs> I, I don't know. I remember him. He didn't spend much time in class. He spent a lot of time in the principal's office. Oh, I, I see. Well, then, um, you must have some good memories of him, Principal Koontz. I never knew a boy so fascinated by fire. I, I was always confiscating his matches. No good punk. His whole family was rotten. Uh, Mayor, Mayor Brody, uh, do you have any memories of Jackie? Oh, remember Jackie. No, I can't say I do. I didn't see his show once, though. You think I can get on that? Howdy. Hi. Howdy, partner. Everything going smoothly, Laura? Yeah, yeah. Oh, I know. I, Laura, I feel like I have stumbled into a rural paradise. I mean, nobody calls me Weasel. Everyone just gives me a big, friendly smile. And today, you ready? Perfect stranger comes up, gives me a pat on the back. I mean, you people, I... Oh, God. Oh. <laughs> Doug, Doug, you, you have a... Yeah. Oh, well, I have no time, Laura. A couple of my new friends are going to teach me how to milk a bull. <laughs> well, anyway, um... Uh, Mayor Brody, what do you say uh, to giving Jackie the key to the city later? Key to the city? He'll rob us blind! No, no, no. It's, 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 it's not an actual key. What it, would you just excuse me for a minute, please? Jerry, what am I supposed to do? I'm supposed to be doing this heartwarming special about Jackie Thomas and everyone from his hometown doesn't even remember him or hates his guts! God, you're beautiful. Oh, come on, Jerry, please, not now. You're right, you're right. When? Hey, everybody! You guys got my spontaneous ad libs? Yeah. Hey, everybody. <laughs> I saw that. No note passing in this class. I, I, I've had it with you, too. Go to the blackboard, draw circles, and put your noses in them. <laughs> hey, Laura, who are these people? Uh, uh, your former biology teacher, the mayor and the principal. Oh, yeah. How you guys doing? I didn't hang around the old school very much, except on Frog Day. <laughs> no good punk. <laughs> hey, you know what's weird? I make more in one week than you guys do a whole year all put together. <laughs> you must be damn proud of me, huh? <laughs> Jackie. Yeah. It's my old desk. Um, well, folks, since you don't have any nice memories of Jackie... Well, I just remembered something. Oh, good. It cost you ten grand. <laughs> I can make something up for seventy-five hundred. For five grand, I'll keep my mouth shut. Fellow citizens, we've got to stick together on this. How about, uh, eight grand a piece and a spot on the show? I'm gonna have to get back to you on that one, Mayor. Laura! Look, my old desk hasn't changed a bit since the accident. Still smells like kerosene. Jackie, listen, none of these folks seem to have any memories of you that we can afford, so it's really critical that we track down your father, or this whole thing is just gonna fall apart. Okay. Okay, Dad will be at the house this afternoon, I guarantee it. All right, great. Hey, I got some lobsters boiling up in the jacuzzi. I gotta get home. <laughs> no, no, give her thicker ankles. And a mustache. Are we gonna get in trouble for doing this? We're grown men. What you gonna do to us? Oh. Uh, 
He did it. No, he made me. <laughs> Jackie got into some trouble as a young lad, but he was the finest son in Iowa. <laughs> you were the finest dad, buddy. <laughs> Is this how you picture Jackie's father? Oh, yeah, exactly. Except in a tower with a rifle. <laughs> I love you, Pa. I love you too, son. <laughs> I have never seen this man before in my entire life. He's the town drunk. What are you doing here, Dad? Wait a minute, wait a minute. You're Jackie's father? Damn straight. I'm Arlen Thomas, and that's the fruit of my lose. McDonald. Thomas! Out of my house, you pinch loaf! <laughs> Dad, I thought you were gonna be in Vegas. What'd you do with the money I gave you? I invested it. Liquid asset. <laughs> Jackie, I just cannot believe that you did this to us. We've wasted the entire morning. All you guys, and all you could afford is one hooker? Hey! <laughs> Laura? Laura, I'm sorry. Laura? He's been a drunk ever since he went on disability. Yeah, damn meat saw turned on me. Took off the thumb on this hand and the finger on this one. Wait, wait a minute, wait a minute. So you had six fingers on each hand? <laughs> Never stopped to add them up. <laughs> yeah, I guess I did. Excuse us, Jackie. Elmer, Delmer, I'm glad to see you guys. You're here for Dad, right? Well, actually... What's he doing this time? Bothering the livestock? No, no, no. We picked him up every day at four. It's preventative incarceration. <laughs> Folks around here just kind of sleep easier, knowing his pickup truck won't be crashing through their bedroom wall in the middle of the night. Oh, is, that, is that constitutional? No. You got a problem with that, hippie? <laughs> no. I have never been so humiliated in my entire life. Get him out of here, guys. You got an outstanding warrant, Jackie. <laughs> Thank you very much. <laughs> he means we got to arrest you. Arrest Jackie? What for? Remember how you got drunk last time you was in town? Plowed up all them graves, planted all that corn? Yeah, well, the Hudgens family's pressing charges. You know how they get about their dad. Well, well, that was a long time ago. What about the Statute of Liberties? No, no don't film this. Don't, 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 don't film yeah, come this. Come on, they won't beat him if the cameras are on. Turn it off. <laughs> Laura! <laughs> hey, what's the news from the slammer? Gomer and Goober said I couldn't post bail till the morning. Good news, though. There was a reward for Jackie's arrest. They paid me from the parking meter fund. So, what is the sound of the men working on the chain gang? Is it actually, ooh, ah, ooh, ah? <laughs> it's not funny, no, too. Yeah. I'm so stressed out, I can't even think. Well, if you spent the day with me, you'd be totally relaxed by now. Oh, I know that I've been ignoring you, but I just I have so much work to do tonight. Yeah, like uh, getting a permit to shoot anywhere in town? Yes, as a matter of fact. And getting a list of people that actually remember Jackie? <laughs> yes. And getting a list of people who actually remember Jackie and actually like him? <laughs> I got a better thing upstairs. Jerry, you are my hero. I think you're really gonna like this. Come on, Jerry, what's going on? It's pitch black in here. Aloha. Oh my god, what is all this? Uh, no, no, no questions. Just fantasies on the Isle of Iowahu. <laughs> You didn't really think I was going to fall for this, did you? Ah, oh, well, that's where the rum comes in. Yeah. <laughs> Might I? Pretty slick, Jerry. What are you, this year a senior? Yeah, I, I guess I'm not very good at this romantic stuff. Huh? Hold on, moon doggy. I didn't say it wasn't working. Can I have that drink now? Where are, uh, 
Bobby and Grant. This could use a little more rum, you know. Uh, I sent the kids out for ice cream. How about Doug? Did you get the door? Uh, the Hill Boys took him on a snipe hunt. I don't know. It's still Jackie's bed. Um, new mattress. Here's the receipt. <laughs> and they said you weren't romantic. Come over here, you big kahuna. <laughs> Oh, my God, Jerry, the guns went off. <laughs> Not all of them. Come on. Starting tomorrow, we're going to be arresting you around 3.30, so try and be ready, all right? <laughs> You never have told me how you like my show. I can't watch it. Too much you. <laughs> Don't you ever give them other characters a chance to talk? <laughs> and how come you're always shouting your lines? It gives me a headache. <laughs> all right, all right. <laughs> you just had to show up and humiliate me, didn't you? Me humiliate you? Well, what about you hiring some phony actor to impregnate your own dad? <laughs> what the hell about me? You're still doing the same stuff you always did, getting drunk and being mean to me. Why do you think I ran away from home? Hell, son, you were 30 years old. <laughs> Don't think I wouldn't count the days, either. <laughs> you were never once nice to me or mom. Hey, I love that woman. Then how come you never married her? <laughs> you don't know what it's like growing up, kids calling you a bastard. Everywhere I went, even when I left town, people still called me a bastard. Somehow they knew. <laughs> you want to know the real reason I didn't marry your mother? Because she wouldn't marry me. She was always in love with Jack Fry, but he was already married. She told me she didn't believe in marriage, but I always knew she was saving herself for Jack in case he ever got divorced. Then one day, Jack got killed in a car wreck. That night, your mother killed herself. You think there's a connection? <laughs> you are my son. <laughs> Dad, you're wrong about Mom. She did love you. No, she didn't. Who could love a freak? I mean, look at these. <laughs> Every time I walk down the street, people point and stare. <laughs> they don't point because your hands, Dad. They point because you're the town drunk. <laughs> Why don't you let me put you in rehab? Lose my identity? <laughs> well, what would I tell people when they ask me what I do? <laughs> Being the town drunk, that's a young man's game. Getting sober was good for me, Dad. Jackie, as long as I can remember, you were always saying, stop interfering in my life. All I'm asking from you is to stop interfering in mine. Leave your old man alone. What the hell? I guess you're never going to do anything you don't want to do yourself, right? I'm glad we were able to have this little talk. <laughs> Say, this ain't going to stop them checks from coming, is it? No. Thank you.
to say, Jerry, what you lacked in ability, you made up for in speed. Thanks. I'm kidding. It was wonderful. You, uh, think that's it already? Yeah, I'll play it back for you in the car. <laughs> Let's go get that ice cream now. <laughs> Guys, we got some great news. Move over, Doug. <laughs> It's me, Jackie. <laughs> Jack, I thought Laura said that you weren't going to get out of prison till tomorrow. Well, see, in Iowa, celebrities are above the law, so they had to let me go. <laughs> <laughs> you went out in the cornfield, didn't you? I got lost, Jackie. And the next thing I knew, these little children were going to try to tie me to a stake. And you ran from them? They were going to sacrifice me to some corn god. Oh, thanks a lot, Doug. There goes next year's crop. Guys, guys, do you mind? Yeah, do you mind, Doug? We're trying to have a little talk here, okay? Do you mind? You're going to have to leave. <laughs> Actually, Jackie, I, I was thinking, you know, that... Uh... You'd like me to finish the story? That's okay, right, I, uh... <laughs> got my dad to go to rehab. Great, how'd you do that, Jackie? Well, I got him real drunk. And <laughs> then when he passed out, I forged his name on some papers and shipped him off. He's gonna be pretty mad when he wakes up. <laughs> but even better yet, I found out why I'm a bastard. Well, now everyone knows. <laughs> it's really good to be home, guys. <sighs> You know, all the time I lived here, and I never realized how close we were to the ocean. <laughs> Geometry was never my best subject. Put the remote down and take two steps back. Do it! Mayor Brody, take one. Uh, Jackie Thomas. Yeah, everybody always loved him. Well, they didn't always love him. They didn't even like him. Yeah, but, oh, but they did love Bubba Wheeler. <laughs> Who was Jackie Thomas? Cut. <laughs> Mayor Brody, take two. Uh, the thing I remember about Jackie was that uh, he used to drop by the barbershop every Saturday and get a crew cut. Well, it wasn't every Saturday, but he did get a crew cut. Or was it a flat top? <laughs> no, that was Bubba Wheeler. Cut. <laughs> Mayor Brody, take three. I can honestly state that I have never met a finer young man than Jackie Thomas. <laughs>